Honorable members of the semi parliament, dear colleagues, what a pleasure to be able to address you today at the launch of Europe's newest Interreg program. I find it rather encouraging that you are taking cooperation to the next level by merging two programs to achieve, hopefully, a greater result. You are definitely shining and star examples of cross-border cooperation. You build on a long tradition of cooperation between the northern regions of Finland, Sweden and Norway from long before Interreg existed, as well as several generations of successful Interreg programs in this area, especially Botnia Atlantica and North, whose merger we celebrate today. And it is amazing to witness what you have accomplished preparing this merger so well in such a short time and in difficult conditions when physical meetings were not possible. But this energy and enthusiasm, this competence and capacity, we will need it even more for the challenges of the future. And we'll need the Aurora program for three key challenges. First, of course, is the challenge of climate change. Uh, the northernmost regions are on the forefront of climate change. These challenges cross borders, so the solutions must also be cross-border. Aurora can play an important role enabling new partnerships and more streamlined interventions for climate mitigation and adaptation and the green transition. Your region faces specific challenges because of its location, but also because of its scale. At the same time, the specific character of this region, the cold climate, the vast distances, can become test beds of technology in Arctic conditions, testing green usage of natural resources, innovative e-health solutions to, capable of offsetting distance and much more. I note here, the innovative tradition of the two programs being merged, which developed no less than six research and development competence centers. I challenge you to be even more innovative, if that is possible, of course. The second challenge is to protect the precious cultural heritage of the Sami people, a unique way of life, in close relationship with the environment, makes you unique uniquely exposed also to climate change, and I know this threatens your way of life. But you also possess a rich store of practical knowledge that can help not only you, but also others across Europe and perhaps across the world. And the Aurora program provides a unique opportunity for SEMI to continue to work together with other Swedish, Finnish and Norwegian partners and this is crucial for building mutual trust and achieving common goals. I know that in previous programs, there were 8,500 participants in activities related to preserving Sami culture, and I hope this continues. But I also hope to see a greater involvement of Sami in, in entrepreneurship, research, innovation, and environmental projects. I trust that the Aurora program can contribute to this. But this goes beyond the semi and brings me, and this brings me to my third point. I know that your regions face a key challenge in ensuring the supply of important professional skills in a cross-border context. I am happy that the Aurora program will support education and deal with border obstacles in this field. I will close by saying how fitting I find the beautiful name you have chosen. Aurora, of course, pays tribute to the beautiful polar lights for which your regions are justly famous. But Aurora is also Latin for dawn. And to me, it is a welcome reminder of our hope for a new day. We need it. All of us in Europe could do with a new day. A new day of recovery from COVID and, I hope, a peaceful resolution to the terrible war in Ukraine, 
but also a new day of a green and digital economy and of better understanding across borders. Aurora can lead the way, the dawn of test beds of new green technology, the dawn of even better cooperation across borders and preservation of the cultural heritage and the dawn of new skills and new competencies, all supported by streamlined governance and the innovative merger at which you have shown yourselves to be so adept. A new day indeed. I am proud to welcome Aurora to the Cohesion Policy family. Thank you very, very much.